Guys, good morning, greetings and salutations, man. It's your host with the most, Paul Cantu, and today we are hitting some estate sales, man. A ton of them, or at least a few, and hopefully I can find some vintage clothes, some things to flip, some things to keep, maybe something for my garden, my yard, my house, my home, whatever the case may be. It's time to hit these sales and find some things that are fresh as hell. Let's go. First spot, let's see what they got. Uh, let's get ready to rumble! All right, upon entering the premises, I'm like a hunting dog, man. I'm trying to sniff out these clothes. This was a huge house with a ton of eclectic items, but I am a clothes connoisseur. So that is what I was looking for. And I was confused with the layout of this house because this bathroom was so huge and the closet was so big. It's like damn near the size of a trailer or something. All right, found the shirts. This is a huge closet, 20. Yikes. Tripping. Oh, but they got the single stitch Dalmatian tees. Oh man, the Disney one goes crazy. That's crazy. And the Wrangler. Hey, real comfortable jeans if it's Wrangler. You'll entangle her. I'm comfortable in Wrangler. This is a cool piece. This is a sweet piece as well. Yeah, I'm grabbing this for sure. Please be a shirt. Oh my God, look at these shorts. These are so funky, man. These are so funky. Then the Nike Essential Tee, all embroidered. Pants. Pants. Tee. Socks. What's going on? Do y'all have a whole table? Uh, yeah, right up front here. There's the black table right next okay, to the awesome. check out. And before I put this on it, how much do you have on this? Uh, it's right here. I had 50 on it. 50? Yeah. Ooh. Are yeah, those negotiable? Cool. Uh, not today. Uh, today's first day. Those are those are breaking $100 on mine and stuff quite a bit, so. Stop the cap. It's a good jacket. All right, I'm uh, I'm not going to put it on the whole table. Dang, I didn't see that price tag. Trippy. All right, let's see what's up the stairs. Oh my gosh, dude. Did a pimp live here? I'm sorry, these jackets are nuts. What's the price? Seven five. Three hundred. God, three hundred on the fur coats. My lord. That's cr that's crazy. That's crazy. Man, this lady loved Dalmatians. Hey, she hated other furry animals though. Anyways, I continued in the house, man. There was a ton of little trinkets, knickknacks, paddy wax, and then I saw the Star Treks. That's cool, Star Trek cards. Wow, this chair is pretty sweet. And the Snoopy suitcase, 25. Man, that's fire though. And the Snoopy phone. 50. Yikes. Tripping. Okay, I gotta look up some of these things, man. See if they're even worth it. Yeah, I wanna sell for 25, man. Tripping. Then I continued in the rest of the house and there was a ton of artwork. And overall, this person definitely had an eclectic collection of items. They had an eye, some cool decorative ladders, tons of books. Again, the knickknack collections were out of this world. Dude, look at this lamp though. What? But there was really nothing that struck my fancy and that was low priced enough for me to want to go ahead and scoop up. How much are the t shirts? $2 each. Okay, that's cool. I got three t shirts? Yeah. And then how much are the shorts? Two. Perfect. All right. Well, thank you so much. Okay, thanks. I'm not hey, good luck with the rest of the sale. I'm put this down. All right, guys, we're out of there. I got like five items. I got this high ass alligator that was stitched in. And you know the wee sticky. It's really old school looking, so I had to get it. A couple of single stitch Dalmatian tees. This one was grandmother crafted. Very cool single stitch Pongo tee. This one is a bit of a larger size, but it is insane. And it does got that wrap around. Each tee was $2. <laughs> and then you got the Team Nike Essential. And then Maybe something I'll potentially wear. This insane Fresh Prince of Bel-Air-esque printed on shorts. Now the house was packed out with items. There was a lot of cool trinkets and furniture that I would want for my house, 
but I'm just not trying to spend full price on items and I'm really trying to refrain from getting stuff I don't need. But nevertheless, got a good amount of stock, items, things. Let's go on to the next spot and see what else the day has in store for your boy. Wait, do what? Oh, that's whack. So just to give y'all some background, I have not seen this type of system since the damn COVID lockdowns, bruh. All right, Jake. All right, let's see. And to get some context, no one who walked out the house had bought a single item until that lady with the little basket. There's only one room. <laughs> Meaning only one room in this whole house was available to browse in. Like a yeah, they got lampshades on deck. What you going for, bro? Here. Oh, no, I see. Now to give even more context, nothing in the house had a price, and evidently when people were asking for the prices, they were high as hell. So yeah, this sale especially blew major popsicle stands because I waited 45 minutes just to get in to hopefully find some interesting things, to hopefully get some good content. So yeah, smash the like button for me waiting for absolutely a big old nice. nothing burger. All right, so one room is open. How are the t-shirts? Oh, they Horrendous. like five of them or something like that. They're all <laughs> five shirts. Haynes, Blank, New Age. Yeah, nothing has prices. God damn. Hey, Kermit's pretty cool. Yeah, five bucks. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you don't need a big old thing of Tupperware? No, I throw that stuff out. <laughs> All right, so that estate sale was tragically ass, okay? Um, I had to get out of there. They only had the living room and one bedroom open out of like a four bedroom house. Nuts. But with that being said, man, that is the game. Don't hate the player, hate the game, yet egg. Um, but yeah, going to a state sales definitely is a time investment and sometimes you catch a big fat L. But two L's yo, make yo. it dub. And she nice it, and she smells sweet, ice it. Take her to the room, knock her down, Mike Tyson. All right, dude. so I had to stop by a thrift store, the salve, to see if they have anything to try and salvage uh, what just happened at the last spot. Let's get in here. All right, man, so this is a great constellation. A couple of things off a rip. The spindle top hot rod run, nine, six single stitch this has the same patina as my teeth pretty white but at the same time slight yellowing anyways it is what it is guys tartar it builds up you also got the speedo vintage crew neck this is crazy, crazy. and of course this just gives you a hell of yachts there's all these thrash soccer jerseys too which i would love to get but every single one of them is tragically beaten all the way up rest in peace man Rest in peace. Oh man, this one is clean though. You have the Emperor's new groove. Alpaca encrusted cardigan. Dude, my mission is to make cardigans go hard again. Y'all know these things to be self-evident. Come on. Dang, you also got Barack Hussein O Drama, the presidential rap tee. This is huge, man. This is like tablecloth size my size so i'm about to go ahead and dip out of here last two little garment finds man you got the justice league tee that goes hard four and then you got tigger straight to the disney live i definitely feel better about the day knowing i came here praise the lord let's get it so there it is big shout out to the salvation army man always coming through i don't know what's going on with my voice right now but i gotta go ship a bunch of orders thank you to everyone who does purchase stuff on the website I love y'all, man. My website goes hard. So I do sell on whatnot, but the website always is blessing with hella items in stock, okay? So get up on there, fool, if you want or don't. Either way, I still love you. I'll adopt you. I'll kiss you, incest. Anyways, you're not blood related to me though, so is it okay? It's, it definitely is like an adult film category of style. But without further ado, man, I gotta get to work. I will catch y'all another day. What's good? So it is Sunday right now, and it is 50% off at the first estate sale I went to and already went there. And my God, I thought there would still be items and everyone went through there and cop shit either yesterday or today because they said they would open at 12 and when I pulled up, rest assured the house was full of people and it was 11.45. I even asked the lady, what time do y'all open? She goes, yeah, we open right at 12. 
looks at her phone and it's 11.50. Bro. So yeah, some adventures, man, they just don't end the way you plan. But yeah, man, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. I know it was a shorter one. Some things did not go the way I intended, but thus is the game of trying to find vintage flame. Regardless of the fact, I still did secure some cool teas. I did go to some extra effort to try and get more content, to try and get some items for lower prices, but it is what it will be. If y'all enjoyed, please smash the like button. It definitely helps me out. Then I will catch y'all in a couple of days with some brand new content. Until next time, live the dream, eat that ice cream. Peace. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life by Rooster. And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to.